Well, you know, we dug ourselves a hole at 26 over par the first day. That was kind of where we we sealed our own fate, and we knew it, but we still were fighting back and actually had a good round going yesterday until the last three holes, and today played a reasonable round going through the front nine, and then kind of things came unraveled. Um, not sure really everything. I'm going to kind of have meetings with the guys and kind of see, you know, maybe do some summaries and figure out what we might could learn from this. I feel like these guys uh, gave it everything they, they could possibly give me this year, so I'm real happy with their effort, happy with um, the way they grew together as a team. That's real, real special when a team grows and to love each other as much as these guys do. Yeah, that's my first recruiting class, and they'll always be my first recruiting class at Baylor, and uh, so proud of them. They, um, we were really emotional after the round because um, they both come a long way, and they've both done a lot of things. And, you know, I told them, this might not be the result we wanted this week, but since we've been, uh, you've been at Baylor in the four years, we've won 11 golf tournaments. We have won a regional championship. We've been ranked number one in the country at one point. We've won a conference match play championship. And they've been ranked consistently in the top 25 that entire time. And in two years, we finished in the top 12. So I made match play at the national tournament. So Braden and Garrett didn't finish on the note they wanted to, but they have nothing to be ashamed of. Amazing. So proud of them. And um, they'll, like I said, they'll always be my first recruiting class at Baylor. Well, I know this. Um, there's an army of parents and grandparents and uh, extended family, if you will, that come to every tournament. So we always have support. They, uh, they're there through thick and thin. And uh, that's the most emotional I've seen a, a group of parents after a, a tournament, maybe in my 34-year coaching career, which tells me they got very close, which tells me that they spent a lot of quality time together and that they're... Uh, that they've developed some bonds and some friendships that are going to last a long, long time.